The newest Harley Quinn episode is technically not a Harley Quinn episode. It's more of a Joker episode. A Joker who's now living the everyday family life as an everyday father and ultimately decides to become a mayor which is something that Jim Gordon doesn't want and Jim Gordon has no plan on what he's going to do when he becomes mayor he has no idea what uh, plan he had for Gotham and so everything's going against him and Two-Face might not be exactly who he seems. Okay, the name should have given it away. It's Two Face. And so Joker is running for mayor. Ultimately, the two characters and their plot lines collide at the end when Two Face reveals himself to be a mastermind behind all the mayor candidates' uh, pr killings that have been going on that series. And is doing whatever he can to get back into the DA and basically reclaim his rightful spot there. And so kidnaps the Joker's son and also because Joker joined for mayor he's starting to lose sight of what his family really means to him. And so that also is, has that going for it. And so the two plot lines collide. The Joker wreck reconciles with his son and family. Uh, Gordon ultimately loses his job at, and gets fired after he is he quit running for mayor at the end. And so Joker is now mayor of Gotham and Harley Quinn and Poison Ivy show up in some pretty weird shirts. And we're like, we were gone for four days. What's going on? This to me felt like a filler episode. The definition of a filler episode. Uh, that doesn't really focus much on the actual main character storyline. It decided to focus on some of the other character storyline. But I think they've done this sort of thing before in one of the other seasons. Be and to be honest, I still very much like this episode. Sure, it was a very filler episode. But... Overall, I'd say that for what's doing with the side characters here, I think is definitely going to be something that will be uh, explored later on because there's no way that they would dedicate an entire episode to these characters and not do anything with them later on. Uh, and I think what they're doing is very interesting. I think it's going to be a very unique dynamic with Joker and Harley Quinn now, now that he's mayor. How that's going to affect the Batman and the Bat family. Basically, what they're doing with Joker here, I very much like. I think it is an interesting and funny direction. Um, I'm hoping that we get to see him turn back into the villain that he we love him to be. Because I doubt that they're going to keep him as a family guy. It's a Joker. Uh, if you don't have him be villainous or make villainous plans then you're losing the essence of the Joker. There's also bits of Joaquin Phoenix Joker here with the dresses that the Joker wears and also a bit of Jack Nicholson callbacks too. Um, so yeah, the I love that. I love the callbacks that they have here. Um, with Two-Face, again, it's what you expect from Two-Face. What they're doing with Gordon is going to be very interesting to see in how he's going to rekindle his relationship with Barbara Gordon. Uh, overall, I very much enjoyed it. Sure, it's a filler episode, but I think it's a really good filler episode that does a lot for the side characters to make them enjoyable. So, that's my opinion on it. What do you guys think of this episode of Harley Quinn? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Let me know in the comments down below, and I'll see you guys next time.